hello everyone I am the play gamer 3 and this is part one of my playthrough of juggernaut for the PlayStation 1 console juggernaut is a psychological horror themed adventure game developed by the Japanese company token house in the game you play as a unnamed young man whose girlfriend Sarah has been possessed by a evil demonic force. You must travel inside Sarah's mind in order to destroy the evil demon living inside of her. The gameplay is similar to the Myst games. The game is played in the first person's perspective and you must solve a variety of puzzles and riddles. This game is one of the strangest and unique type of games I have ever played on the PlayStation 1. Um, the less you know about the game, the better because the game gets weird and complex. So let's begin the let's play. So yeah, it's a um, pretty uh, creepy um, intro. Okay, so this is the game. I mean, like I said before, the game is similar to the Myst series. So everything is played in the first person's perspective. And the graphics are all um, either 2D or 3D graphics well pre-rendered graphics I'm 
whoa, um, honey, um, you didn't tell me we was going to be role-playing Fifty Shades of Grey tonight. Okay, so I guess the doll's gonna watch. I mean, hey, is that what you're into? And wait, hey, um, who's that guy standing right there? I mean, you didn't tell me um, anything about, you know, having a threesome or anything. Okay, yes, who are you? Yes, uh, I know she's tied up. Well, to me, it looks like she's been tied up or she's being robbed or something. Yeah, exactly. I'm clueless. Okay, I didn't know evil forces lived in bottles. Oh, so it's my fault. See, that's what you get for buying your girlfriend's gifts. Um, so how was I supposed to know an evil spirit was living in a bottle? Doctor now. Annabelle. Yeah, ne never date a girl <laughs> that has a creepy doll lying around. Yep, that's some poltergeisting, all right. about now <laughs> oh, 
I think he's talking about me. I mean, yeah, I mean, you're the priest. Uh, do I have to? I mean, we're not that much a good couple. It's not like she's my wife or anything. I mean, oh, great. He's a he's a good boyfriend because that was me. Yeah, she'd be she'd be on her own <laughs> right about now. Yeah, I guess it's gonna be needing this cross. trouble so are you coming with me by any chance well it kind of already did That knife. <laughs> okay, so yeah, that was weird and creepy. Yeah, it'd be nice if this game had voice acting. My beloved Sarah. I mean, like I said, that was my girlfriend. Yeah, she'd be on her own. Sorry. Demon possession is not justified. <laughs> This on this for me looks as if it's were a bag filled with blood. Okay, so right now I'm in my um girlfriend's messed up <laughs> mine. Okay, that's the pendant. So you use the pendant to save your game.
Okay, I found something. Foot shaped burns. So, someone burned to death on the pier? Yeah, so I'm wondering, is he physically in her in his girlfriend's mind or is he still at the house? You know, his physical body, but whoa, what's this? Oh, okay, it's a it's a priest guy. Okay, so that was a riddle clue. Okay, so like I was saying, is he physically inside of her mind or is his consciousness inside of her consciousness? So, you know, in the real world, he's, I guess he's laying on the floor right beside her while the priest is... Mm, okay, I was gonna make a <laughs> an appropriate priest joke, but yeah. Oh yeah, there's a map. Yeah, you're gonna need this map because you can get lost. inside this tower thing oh someone's there hello dear um let's see whoa destroy souls that must be the the demon exit from this world yeah I would like to exit this world well it's already a blood filled moon or well, sun out there and it becomes one with a blood filled uh, more riddles Okay, I think I, I messed that one up, so gotta choose the right answer. There's no need to, well, exactly, there's no need to be here, but I'm here, so can you stop talking in riddles and just answer straight answers? Okay, the mansion. Please take me to the mansion. When will it appear? I'm not allowed to leave here. Okay, thanks. Okay, I think I messed that one up again. Okay, so he can't take me, but he can sh tell me when it's going to appear. Okay, I think I got it right. Okay, so what are you doing? He transformed into a bird cage. A bird cage with a watch in it. Okay, six o'clock.
Okay, so I guess there's nothing left for me to do here. I mean, I cannot talk to the to the bird cage. Yeah, so again, you're inside of your girlfriend's mind, so yeah, she thought of <laughs> all of this. Oh, I was supposed to go back up. Okay, there's another flight of stairs. Okay, anything here? Okay, there's no painting on the easel. And there's another easel. Okay, so I guess I gotta go look for a painting. Okay, make sure I'm going the right way. Oh, what is this? Some on the ground. Ah, a painting. So I'm wondering, why would... So I'm inside of her mind, right? So she created all of this, so... Why would someone create, I don't know, a world with, you know, random puzzles? I mean, so the, the odd case someone goes into your mind, you're just going to create a world filled with puzzles and riddles just to toy with someone. Okay, let's see what's down here. So there was two easels, so oh, well, this is supposed to be the second painting. I don't know, it's a record. Okay, so I got a record. Okay, there's no way to combine the two. Okay, so I guess I go back to the tower and put the painting on one of the easels.
Okay, so which one should I put the painting on? I guess I'll do the one on the right. Okay, did anything happen? Okay, so a painting looks like one of the pathways in the forest, so guess I'll check outside and see if anything changed. Okay, so one of the pathways must have uh, changed when I put the painting on the easel. Okay, this is a dead end, so it must be the other way. Okay, so, ah, 33, so that's the, the record had 33 on it. Ah, and that's a phonograph. Okay, red door, blue door. Okay, let's check out the phonograph first, see what's on the, the record um, A side Um, so did you guys um get that? <laughs> Cause I sure didn't. Well, I just put the record on there. Okay, let's do the B side. Okay, my girlfriend's taste of music sucks. Okay, let's check on the door. First bar. Okay, so this is a puzzle. So as you can see, the doors are playing the same tune that's on the record so first bar okay so you have to um, go through the right door that's on the um, the record so let's play the record again so you gotta match the tune on the record with the tune on the door. So. So the record has four, four bars of music. So I gotta match the same tune with the, the door. OK, 
okay that sounds like the first tune okay so they both they both sound like the same um, tune so um, I guess let's try the red yeah they sound the same so okay okay so now I gotta match the door with the second um, tune oh no it's the first one Okay, that doesn't sound like the second bar. Okay, I think I did the did the first bar repeat itself. Yeah, I might have to listen to the record again. Oh, okay, that was right. Okay, now I gotta find a third bar. Okay, that sounds like the ending. Okay, so that was the that was the wrong door and someone's laughing at me. Okay, so that does it for part one. So what have we learned? Um, if you are in a old antique shop and you see a bottle, eh, don't buy it. It might contain a evil <laughs> demonic spirit. So yes, I'll see you guys in part two.